Free driver education to help you ace your driving test. Truby Cars. Hello everyone, this is Mandeep from uh, Truby Cars. So in this video, we are in uh, Kitchener Waterloo area and uh, we are going to cover some of the driving rules here. So if you're going for your uh, G2 test or your G test, um, this video is definitely going to help you out. Uh, we will look at um, stop signs, uh, left turns, uh, right turns, and uh, lane change, highway driving as well. So let's uh, get started. So anytime you move from a parked position, you are required to signal and shoulder check. So here I'm going to uh, signal left, left uh, mirror check left shoulder check and it looks clear so that means we can uh, we can go maintaining distance from the parked vehicle right um, signal and shoulder check we are turning right on the stop sign um, so we stop before the stop line so the first thing on um, you know uh, the first thing you look for is a stop line if there's no stop line then you stop before the sidewalk some intersections have no sidewalks so then you can stop before the edge of the intersection now this uh, stop sign it's always so that means all directions have a um, stop sign so we already made a complete stop here no other vehicles here no pedestrians so that means we are good to go going around this parked car i can signal and shoulder check again and uh, i am maintaining distance from parked vehicles and i'm doing shoulder check uh, to pull back to the right hand side uh, there's someone jaywalking so i'm just slowing down speed limit sign here maximum 40 kilometers and um, on the next uh, intersection, we will be turning right. So your signal should be on about 30 meters before the intersection. So after the side street here, now we can put the signal on. This is another uh, all way intersection. So same thing here, we do a full stop. We check for uh, pedestrians, uh, other vehicles, uh, shoulder check to the right. And uh, we came before the blue car. So that's why it was, you know, our right of way to go before the blue car. Uh, we are going straight ahead uh, from this uh, intersection so you always want to look at the road markings so if you look at the road markings here right so from this lane you can go straight or left uh, from the right hand lane you can only turn right so very important points uh, for your driving test uh, because you know um, if your examiner um, here's another thing in your driving test if your examiner does not give you directions like if he's not saying anything that means you go straight okay so they otherwise they would say okay left turn next right turn next uh, if the examiner doesn't say anything that means you continue straight and then you have to look at the signs road markings to see which lane you're supposed to be in so when the light turns green we're going to quickly scan the intersection left straight right and then uh, we will go straight ahead so you always want to make sure the cross traffic has stopped but in this case uh, the oncoming traffic already has a uh, green light and advance um, you know um, turn for the left turns as well okay so uh, from this intersection now uh, we are uh, we are still going straight now there is a green light and there's a walking man sign so that means the light will stay green i'm scanning the intersection again and uh, I'm looking in my rear view mirror as well, um, you know, uh, so this way I know what's happening around my vehicle. On the right hand side, uh, now we have a bicycle lane, there is a school area sign uh, as well. So you want to read all the signs, scan intersections, and if you're in residential area, look for, uh, you know, uh, kids playing on the road. Okay, so... Um, so from here uh, we will uh, still go straight from this uh, intersection now this um, light is uh, red uh, so i'm just uh, slowing down looking in my rear view mirror as well so anytime when you start to break make sure you're uh, checking your rear view mirror as well light turns green uh, so i quickly you know um, scan the road just to make sure um, it's um there's no vehicle uh, running red lights let's do a left turn here so i did uh, left signal and uh, shoulder check and uh, we're gonna be turning left so when you're behind another vehicle make sure you maintain about a car length uh, distance so um, now we are just slowly moving forward uh, the light is already amber now so uh, uh, so that means we have to wait um, for the light to turn green again 
So we stop here before the stop line and um, looking in my rear view mirror as well. There's a white car behind me. They're maintaining distance, so that's good. And um, now when you're on a red light, uh, don't, uh, you know, don't get distracted by um, anything else. Uh, just make sure you still focus on your driving. Uh, you know, you're, um, you should be aware of everything and uh, look at the intersection, see if there are any pedestrians, uh, what the intersection looks like, oncoming vehicles. So right now, like there's, um, you know, one oncoming vehicle there, there's pedestrian who wants to cross the road. So that means um, um, when the light turns green like this, I need to go in the intersection, uh, wait for this vehicle to go first. Now the vehicle is already gone, but uh, the pedestrian is still there. And um, now we are good to go because the pedestrian has crossed as well. On the right hand side, we have a bicycle lane. So that's how you should be driving in your uh, driving test. Free driver education to help you ace your driving test. Truby Cars.